Well, <laughs> so back to you for a second, though. Uh -huh. what, a, a, a super cool and interesting thing you do is uh, playing um, solo guitar accompaniment to silent film. Yes. Sort of in the tradition of the piano yes. accompaniment. Well, and I you're did, doing this now, uh -huh. and you just you did it recently at Metrograph. I have a series on going on at the Metrograph. Oh, you do? Yeah. I've done three this year. They're doing a retrospective, of, because I've done about 12 of these scores, and they're not all for silent films. Some of them, f for instance, the first one I did there was for the Spanish language Dracula. I, you know about that. Okay, from 1931. <laughs> this is quite a good Yeah, when, they, when Bela Lugosi was making Dracula with Todd Browning, at night, they brought in a whole different cast, all Latin actors, uh, and, they, and a British director, not Tab Browning, the director of Dracula, a guy named George Melford. And because they didn't have dubbing facilities in those days, they made an alternate version. They like for the, shot all the scenes? Yeah. And actually, people who've seen an idea to Dracula think that the Spanish Dracula is way more exciting. I'm one of these people. Uh, better visually and better, better editing rhythms. It, the classic Dracula is great for Lugosi, but it's a very static stage play, basically filmed stage play. Anyway, it doesn't have mu music on the soundtrack. So I was invited to play in Havana at the Havana Film Festival with the Proviso. I come up with uh, a Latin film to accompany, preferably silent, but I said, well, wait a second, there's the Spanish language Dracula where there's no music. They couldn't afford a composer, guys. I mean, that's basically right. why. And there were a bunch of films. This was in the Depression. So there's a whole year or two there often where they just skip music or use canned yeah. film music cues. So I said, I'm going to create an underscore to accompany this film. I played that all over the world. I just came back from the Transylvania Film Festival, Transylvania International Film Festival in Cluj, Romania, where I played on June 10th, accompanying a classic Chinese silent film from 1934 called The Goddess. And uh, had you played for played that? Had you accompanied that film before? Yes, uh, I had performed it actually in New York at Symphony Space, uptown. And I've also played it at Pioneer Works in Red Hook. Mm -hmm. And uh, where else did I do it? Mass Mocha mm. out wow. in, uh, yeah. But this was nice because they invited a crew of people from the China Film Archive, which is in Beijing, who had restored the film recently and cleaned it up because the print that was circulating was very tattered and blotched, you know, just grainy. And so it was held in an old church that they had very well lit. And the Chinese contingent loved my score because I used, I used a lot of actual Chinese music. I mean, that's another thing.